Squash Yorker by Adrian Morales. Squash Yorker is a condition resulting from inadequate protein intake. It is an acute form of childhood protein energy malnutrition characterized by edema, irritability, anorexia, ulcerating dermatosis, and an enlarged liver with fatty infiltrates. The presence of edema caused by poor nutrition defines Quash Yorker. Early symptoms include fatigue, irritability, and lethargy. As protein deprivation continues, one sees growth failure, loss of muscle mass, generalized swelling, and decreased immunity. A large, protuberant belly is common. The incidence of quash yorker in children in the U.S. is extremely small, and it is typically found in countries where there is drought and famine. The defining sign of quash yorker in a malnourished child is petal edema. Other signs include a distended abdomen, an enlarged liver with fatty infiltrates, thinning hair, loss of teeth, skin depigmentation and dermatitis. Children with quash yorker often develop irritability and anorexia. Changes in skin pigment, decreased muscle mass, diarrhea, failure to gain weight and grow, fatigue, hair changes, increased, and more severe infections due to damaged immune system, irritability, large belly, that sticks out, lethargy or apathy, loss of muscle mass, rash shock and swelling. Cause. Poor nutrition. Protein deficiency. Effect. Edema. Enlarged liver. Loss of teeth. Quash Yorker is most common in areas where there is famine, limited food supply, low levels of education. This disease is more common in very poor countries. It often occurs during a drought or other natural disaster or during political unrest. These conditions are responsible for a lack of food, which leads to malnutrition. Quash Yorker is very rare in children in the United States. There are only isolated cases, however, one government estimate suggests that as many as 50% of elderly people in nursing homes in the United States do not get enough protein in their diet. When Quash Yorker does occur in the United States, it is usually a sign of child abuse and severe neglect. Getting treatment early generally leads to good results. Treating Quash Yorker in its late stages will improve the child's general health. However, the child may be left with permanent physical and mental problems. If treatment is not given or comes too late, this condition is life threatening. Coma. Permanent mental and physical disability. Shock. Getting more calories and protein will correct Quash Yorker if treatment is started early enough. However, children who have had this condition will never reach their full potential for height and growth. Treatment depends on the severity of the condition. People who are in shock need immediate treatment to restore blood volume and maintain blood pressure. Call your health care provider if your child has symptoms of Quash Yorker. To prevent Quash Yorker, make sure the diet has enough carbohydrates, fat, and protein.
Adrian Ronell's Productions. Adrian Ronell's Productions.